Now we're working the latest development on a firefighter charged with rape. Cody Reed was arraigned this morning, accused of sexually assaulting a 16-year-old girl. I went to news reporter Catherine Sotnik is live in Pawtucket now with the Blackstone Valley Mobile Newsroom. And tonight, Pawtucket police say the alleged sexual assaults took place over a period of years. And we've learned the victim is a 16-year-old girl. And tonight, that firefighter's colleagues here in Pawtucket are calling it a very sad day. 38-year-old Cody Reed, a Pawtucket firefighter, says little in district court Tuesday morning. The nine-year veteran firefighter stationed out of Smithfield Ave has been charged with first-degree sexual assault and second-degree sexual assault. Police say they arrested Reed late Monday night after interviewing the alleged victim, a 16-year-old girl. And while no one came to the door at his Second Street home in Pawtucket, neighbors say they're shocked and saddened by the allegations. I see him all the time. He walks his baby up and down the street, and um, he lives with his girlfriend over there. He's, he, he, I went to high school with his mom. Um, he's a, he, you know, I always thought he was a very nice guy. Police are saying little else about the alleged sexual assaults other than that they happened over several years. Reed is a 1990 graduate of Pawtucket's Tolman High School and a 1995 graduate of URI. His fellow firefighters at Station 5 say Tuesday it's a sad day and they're hurting, as is the community. Very saddened and very surprised. Yes, I am. And the mayor's office here tonight tells me they'll be meeting tomorrow morning to talk about Reed's job status. But for now, he is an active firefighter here in Pawtucket, and he's being held behind bars tonight at the ACI. Reporting live tonight from the Blackstone Valley Mobile Newsroom from Pawtucket, I'm Catherine Sotnik, Eyewitness News.